It is so cool to talk to you both. Thank Don't you tell so. anyone else, but you two are my favorites by far. <laughs> oh, bless you. That's very kind. He's been telling phenomenal. everyone that in every room. No, <laughs> everyone's phenomenal. You two, I, I love your careers, but I Thank love you. you guys in this. Thank, Thank you. you so. Thank you so much. What's it like stepping into this world, these characters, mm. and Zach's imagination? It's. I mean, at first, overwhelming, you know, yeah. and not in a bad way. It's just there's so much to to unpack. There's so much to understand, yes. and then and then you have to figure out well, how in this megalithic entity do I fit in mm -hmm. and fit in seamlessly and do my role in terms of playing my part for the story, yeah. you know. And um, but then you get to work with brilliant creatives such as Jaiman and and Zach is such a key under core understanding of every character, his past, his future, his family, his lineage, the world, the culture that surrounds them. And then it starts making sense. And then you just start going at it day by day, trusting the work, trusting the story, trusting the inner work going on. And somehow I think we pulled it off, but it was, <laughs> it was definitely a lot, you know? Yeah, it sure was a lot, uh, but I must say, um, Regardless, I think uh, what grounds you, it's the story, yeah. first and foremost. Sure. No matter how much uh, uh, fantasy you have going on in your head, no matter how much, I mean, this man's been fantasizing about this uh, sci-fi for uh, th over three decades. Right. You know, I met him when he was in film school and then uh, uh, took pictures of me, <laughs> you know, at the time. And, uh, and it's uh, incredible that, you know, in, in in the mix of making this, he, he found the picture again, and so we have, oh, to, uh, we have to do that again. Yeah, but uh, it was uh, it, it was just extremely grounding. The nature of the story, what was coming off the page, the uh, yeah. uh, the geopolitical uh, um, obstacles that we all have to face mm -hmm. in this mm -hmm. story. And um, and one that resonates to me and really has to do with the, the continent of Africa, how that continent has been, um, you know, uh, indoctrinated for centuries and still mm -hmm. having to, you know, uh, stand for itself. But mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I mean, that was uh, grounding. Mm -hmm. That was um, what really connected me. And then we, of course, uh, he put an amazing, uh, diverse cast together. Uh, stars uh, being Russian and um, Indian, uh, I myself from uh, you know Sub-Saharan Africa, uh, Cora, North Africa, North Africa, Africa uh, Mikhail uh, Dutch, Dutch, I mean European, Europeans, but you know so it was just a very eclectic uh, mm -hmm. sort of like a, you know group of uh, you know cast, and mm -hmm. I think that was beautiful to see. Yeah, what it's is rare? Z it is rare, yeah. mm -hmm. and, and so well told. What is Zach like as a director? Because I, I've heard he's he's actually caring and giving. He's oh, yeah. extremely caring, very giving, uh, childlike, almost uh, childlike. And, but I I must say the the the, the composure in which uh, he carries himself oh, on, yeah. uh, day in and day out on set, which is extremely commendable. Mm. It's impressive, you know. Like uh, John said this a few times. We were it, it's doing. Film, if anyone doesn't know, movie sets, we do 12 to 16 hour days from door to door. You know, sometimes right. 17 hours door to door if the set's quite far away. And that's, that's, a, that's a lot to take on. So there's Zach's doing that every day. You know, we will be doing 85%, let's say, and he's doing 100% of the days. Right. Goes back to his kids, his dogs, goes back to his life, gets up in the morning, goes to the gym, does the same diet as us most of the time. I mean, it's just, it's, 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 it's to have a man with that level of vision and discipline spearhead the ship, mm. it, it, it's impossible not to follow suit. It's such a waste not to follow suit. Yeah, with no complaints. With no complaints. <laughs> <laughs> on the inside. Yeah, well, on the, <laughs> on the, inside. On the outside. On the outside. On the outside. inside. On the inside. Not, I'm sure you're feeling it in the yeah. inside, but you will, never, no. you, know, you will have a hard time articulating it, given the mm. fact that, you know, he, 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 he exudes so much no. of... Uh, 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 that composure and mm. that understanding, mm. you know, being on set, you know, so you really check yourself yeah. before you say anything, right? Mm. Damn straight. Right. What is, is there something you can pick out that you hope the audience takes away from, from this film or your performances? I, I hope people see this as a story not about superheroes, but a story about heroes. Mm -hmm. And I think this is what makes this story relatable. Uh, even though it's set in the magnitude of space, you are watching people 
rise to the occasion or re-rise to the occasion. You're watching people find themselves again. You're you're not like here's a hero. You're here, here's here's a human, or not a human necessarily, but here's a here's here's a individual that I can relate to. Here's some, mm -hmm. here's someone who has been through things that I have been through. And I think the, it's that just the, the human the, element. The the one element uh, that was grounding was also the fact that. Uh, uh, was uh, the uh, Velt. Mm -hmm. Yes, mm -hmm. very true. Velt, which we all, uh, <laughs> that was the only thing that felt real and felt somewhat mm. uh, practical, there you know, practical, tangible, tangible yep. and, uh, you Ed know. said the same thing. Mm -hmm. And, and yeah. again, uh, the rest of it uh, is completely, you know, it's left to one's uh, vision. Again, we all can read the same book and have a completely, sure. a di you know, different take of that mm -hmm. book, same book. And in in, in this case, uh, you know, reading the the, the, the Rebel Moon, uh, it's the geopolitical uh, issues that came off the page mm -hmm. for me. But aside from that, we're in space. Uh, <laughs> it didn't occur to me sometimes that like, uh, you know we're breathing from planet to you know from galaxy yeah, to yeah, galaxy, galaxy and yeah. so, so how we're <laughs> but uh, yeah it's just a, a, a part of a world that uh, uh, we literally have to surrender to uh, Zach's vision yeah. of what that is yeah. and uh, yeah that's fascinating well last I'd like to know is you know looking at what you obviously you filmed the whole thing you filmed part one too what's it like knowing that you know there's still all this stuff to come is there anything that you're you're like sitting on right now going oh my god obviously you can't talk about specifics but it's yeah, just what's that like it's exciting it's exciting you it's, know, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a new way uh a very uh, yeah evolving way to uh, to film these days and to film an epic story Right, and so that's a very progressive and sort of like a approach to uh, trying to tell you the story the way you see it fit. Right. And so Zach just want to have that mm. uh, freedom to uh, to be able to yeah, yeah to tell it the way he wants to. And I think what's really great here is this story. You know, it has to be remembered. This is part one and part two. Mm -hmm. You haven't come off the ride. This isn't a new roller coaster right. ride. This is this is you have been sat at the top of the co coaster. And you're waiting for the drop. You know what I mean? It is a, and it continues. It picks up where it left, le where it left, so where it leaves off, or if that's the where it left off. Jesus, it's the morning. Apologies. It picks up where it left off in the sense that you get more and more of a, an insight into these individuals, how they got there, why they're there, why they're standing up, and why we need to root for them. Mm -hmm. You know, and and I think part two and the extended cut and all of that is all a deeper dive into all this stuff. So I really urge people to, to see it as part one and part two and, right. and, 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 and be excited for, for what's to come because it just keeps going. It's mm -hmm. amazing. And it must be good as an actor to be able to do this all in one go. So. It was actually yeah, really it great. It was actually good. It was very, very at good. At the time, we probably wouldn't say so because it's exhausting <laughs> doing this for seven to eight months physically and emotionally and right. all that stuff. But looking back, I'm so glad we did it this yeah, way. So you know, I hope we do three and four this way. That would be great. Get it done. Thank you so much for Thank your time. You. Thank, Thank you for your time, sir. Really a pleasure.